Hey everybody out there in the internet world, it's your favorite revolutionary socialist, Hippinator13. I'm back. And uh, man, let me just tell you, wow. <clears throat> we are seeing a media frenzy coddling Donald Trump. Uh, Democrats are coddling Donald Trump. Um, you know what I mean? And this, this, this is exactly what they wanted. I mean, you know what I, I mean? I'm, I'm, I mean, I am serious. It just Facebook, meta sites, all these sites, they are just super. I mean, they've been gatekeeping from the left for a long time. They really have. They've been completely gatekeeping from the left. But now, it's, it's really risen to a whole other level, you know what I mean, since this uh, fiasco. Let's call it that. That's what it is. We, we don't really know what really happens. You know what I mean? It, it all looks a little fishy. But let me just tell you right now, man, any, any criticism, you know, it's uh, even more so now. Uh, anything that these uh, wackadoodle, neoconservative, religiously correct, right-wing, radicalized right-wing extremists say is just completely allowed. I mean, it, and it don't matter what it is. It doesn't matter how much they threaten you. Uh, you know what I mean? I've seen pages that have been permanently suspended over criticism. Of Look. You even had Jack Black, you know what I mean? Jack Black's, uh, the guy who's, the gas guy, the guy who started Tenacious D, you know what I mean? He, you know, he's, you know, he said something critical of Trump and man, Jack Black, who's a, he's nothing but a wealthy, self-entitled, privileged Californian. Man, he just went crazy and canceled the tour trying to, you know, oh, we're not, we're not doing it no more. You know what I mean? These fascists are sticking together and look, these billionaires, are all behind Trump now. Now, do you, th do you think they care about you, really? Seriously? You know what I mean? You you think that these, you know, who are, are these billionaires for you? No, they're not for you. They are completely against uh, workers, consumers, and taxpayers. Now, they're nothing but fascists. And they're supporting Donald Trump, neoconservatives, and you know if you if you go over there to youtube and, and google civil war you know and the and post in the past week you know that all these uh radicalized right-wing extremists they're all calling for civil war every one of them so left side you know you, you better you know what i mean you, you you better stop you know with your you know all, all your nonsense bull crap and you better get ready you know, because it it is it is coming. You know, the this is this is the exact same thing that happened in World War II. Workers started rising up and demanding, you know, to be for higher wages, better living conditions, and this is this is what the fascists did. They uh, put these dictators up and used media to gin up all these, you know, these right wing crazies. These, you know what I mean? And it's all happening again. It, 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 you know, France actually knocked it out through a vote. I, I don't think we, the Democrats are not Republican opposition. So, I, if anybody who's thinking that somehow all oh, voting for Democrats is going to do anything, no, it ain't. You're completely lost. This is beyond voting. This is beyond peaceful protest. This is all, you know, this, the only thing that can settle this thing is a revolution, a real old style revolution. You know what I mean? Uh, it's, the United States is ruled by fascist imperialists, Wall Street parasites and corporate predators and just absolutely infested with right wing neo-Nazis and they all wearing a red hat and they're all Trump supporters. These Bidenites, nothing but they're nothing but gullible, naive people believing that the Democratic Party is for workers, consumers, and taxpayers. No, they're not. These policies that they're spewing out right now, they couldn't pass them if they wanted to. And and then the ones that they do get passed, they're just corporate giveaways and they're watered down. 
All right, people, I just wanted to do a video to warn, you know what I mean? Try to warn the left, try to tell you, you know what I mean? You, 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 bet, you better stop with the nonsense and get ready for war because these, these people are calling for war and they can't be reasoned with. They, they're anti-science, they're religiously correct, religiously correct wackadoodles. They can't be reasoned with. There's, there's no reasoning with these people. They only know one language, just like the police and these politicians, and that's violence. It's the only language they understand. All right, I don't want this video going too long. So as usual, until next time, arrivederci.